Close Sports Pulse, USA Today Sports Michael Middlehurst Schwartz looks at the top five quarterbacks of the 2018 NFL Draft and the teams that would be the best fit for each. USA Today Sports amid his purchase of a minority stake in a racehorse and his absence from the start of voluntary workouts, tight end Rob Gronkowski gave New England Patriots fans some positive news. On Tuesday evening, he announced on Instagram that he will return to play next season. I met with coach today and informed him I will be back for the 2018 season with the Pats, Gronkowski wrote on Instagram. I have been working out, staying in shape and feel great. Looking forward to another championship run. Gronkowski was reportedly absent for the start of New England's off-season program, which started April 16, though he did hold a promotional news conference for a motocross event, in the very media workroom where he meets with media members covering the Patriots. Multiple reports indicated that Gronkowski has been at odds with New England regarding a disagreement on training and recuperation methods. Gronkowski has been working with Alex Guerrero, who is quarterback Tom Brady's body coach. Per several reports, Patriots coach Bill Belichick prefers New England's players to use the team's trainers. Gronkowski has dealt with numerous injuries throughout his NFL career but had a very productive 2017 campaign, catching 69 passes for 1,084 yards and a two counts. In three postseason games, he added 218 more yards and three more scores. His return brings a needed sense of consistency to a unit that has lost several parts this offseason. Left tackle Nate Solder, New York Giants, wide receiver Danny Amendola, Miami Dolphins, and running back Deion Lewis, Tennessee Titans, all departed in free agency, while wide receiver Brandon Cooks was traded to the Los Angeles Rams. Follow Lorenzo Reyes on Twitter at Lorenzo Grise. Share your feedback to help improve our site.